leathers on, the foot's on the pedal. Time to kick it into gear and feel the road. Rear Stewart is ready to ride. You just have to look out of your car window to know motorbiking, which was once a boys club, has suddenly exploded into a women's domain. And that goes for Harleys too. I thought it was time to get back into the bikes and always wanted a Harley, so went out and got one and been riding ever since. Not satisfied and not settling for using men's gear and equipment to ride, women are starting to do something about it, so Tony modified her hog. I put a special seat, so a reduce reach seat. I changed the handlebars, had it lowered a little bit, and it fits me great now, so it's just really comfortable. It just feels like it was made for me. Statistics show that women have increased in ridership in the last uh, six years from 17% to 24%, which is pretty phenomenal. There are now 7.2 million riders just in the United States alone. And for women tired of shopping for stuff in a tiny corner of a man-focused bike shop, Greer and her business partner Jolie Baker-Stewart opened West Coast Roar, Canada's first women's motorcycle gear and apparel boutique. And they're finding female bikers are coming out of the woodwork, not just to shop, but also just to hang with like-minded women. What they're looking for with their expendable dollars is an experience. And this is the kind of experience that they're looking for. So instead of just having, you know, more uh, material things to spend their money on, they're looking for a sistership, and that's what we're offering. West Coast Roar supports groups such as the Motorcycle Mamas and they hold classes that teach confidence and skills. They pride themselves on giving women more gear options, everything from pink helmets to black leather. We're bringing in lines that are feminine and they support a woman's figure and you know it's something that you could walk into the grocery store off your bike and you don't look like a, a square box. I mean these are feminine cuts and they're comfortable and functional. The women have had so much success with the store in just a few months, they're planning to move to a new location where they'll get more into customizing bikes for women. So I guess it's time to move over, boys. Meet the new face of motorcycles. But don't worry, the girls will let you ride with them. I ride with women a lot, so I ride with men too, but I have a lot of friends too who ride who are women. In Mill Bay, I'm Terry Church.